Welcome to the course. My name is Francesco Schiavon, and I'm going to be the guide for you. In this course, we're going to be covering a number of tips that are going to help you communicate. Communicate not just for the purposes of sharing your photos, but rather for the purposes of doing business. And personally, I was very excited to do this course because I get to show you a number of tips that I have learned throughout the years. One of the things is this thing called data detectors, where you can grab data from places like email and then use it somewhere else, like in this case, in maps. We do get quite deep working with mail. We get to discuss mailboxes. We get to talk about smart mailboxes, which are pretty much a set of search criteria that would gather mail for you. And although we spend a lot of the time in the course talking about mail, we also get to deal with the contacts. The contacts becomes your database of people that you want to get a hold of. And not only people, things like companies or services, you can certainly keep in the contacts. And the nice thing is that it integrates with iCloud as well as with other web services like Google. But the power of these contacts is when they integrate with things like mail. And you can access that database of contacts from within mail to make sure that you always have the right email address for the person that you want to get a hold of. Further in the course, we get to talk about the calendar. And the calendar, although sounds like a very simple application, it's actually very, very powerful because you can take full calendars and share them with other people. When it comes to individual events, though, we're going to be talking about how to make events recurring and how to use all of the features in the event inspector, which upfront appears to be simple, but in fact has a lot of depth. The first thing that we're going to see is actually an editorial that I have on working with internet accounts. As we integrate our lives more and more with our mobile devices, using the cloud for purposes of communications, particularly things like mail, sharing your contacts, calendars, and so forth, has become common practice. So let's get started. 